Most people believe that mental conditions are rare and happen to someone else, but research shows that an estimated 44 million Americans suffer from one form of mental disorder in a given year. Mental health conditions are common and widespread, you are not free from them. In this video, I will share with you 9 mental illness signs that you should never ignore. 1. Excessive worry Everyone feels anxious now and then. For example, anxiety may arise when you are faced with a problem at work, preparing for an interview, or making an important decision. Although it is customary to be worried under some circumstances, if anxiety becomes part of daily routine and it affects our day-to-day -day existence, then it may be a sign of fundamental mental health condition. These cognitive issues are called anxiety disorders. They are a group of mental illnesses that cause constant and overwhelming anxiety and fear. Some of the indications of anxiety are heart palpitations, headache, breathlessness, diarrhea, and restlessness. The National Alliance of Medical Illness NAMI, establishes that worrying is a natural occurrence. However, when someone can stop worrying over something, it may be a sign of an anxiety disorder, if not correctly handled. Anxiety disorders can make you avoid work, school, family get-togethers, and other social situations that might trigger or worsen your symptoms. 2. Change in sleep patterns Do you know that studies in both adults and children suggest that sleep problems may raise the risk for and even directly contribute to the development of some psychiatric disorders? As casual as we may view it, a good night's sleep is an essential part of a healthy, well-balanced lifestyle. Although it is not entirely understood, the brain is said to base its functionality on a mutual relationship between sleep and mental health. However, neuroimaging and neurochemistry studies propose that a good night's sleep helps foster both cognitive and emotional resilience. In contrast, chronic sleep deprivation sets the stage for negative thinking, emotional vulnerability, and other mental issues. Ideally, the average person will sleep 7 to 9 hours a night. Frequently disturbed or irregular sleep patterns may be a sign of mental illness. Sleeping too much or too little, or not at all, insomnia, may also be a sign of sleeping disorder, depression, anxiety, or substance abuse. According to recent studies, about 50% of patients with ADHD, depression, anxiety, or bipolar disorder have insomnia or hypersomnia. 3. Sudden change in appetite and weight one overall goal amongst individuals is the quest for a perfect physique. Getting the ideal look may mean gaining a few extra pounds or losing that belly fat, depending on your current state. But then again, extreme fluctuations in weight can sometimes be cause for concern. Appetite and weight changes have been seen to be common diagnostic symptoms of major depression. Some behavioral health issues lead people to eat more than usual as means of comfort. This, in turn, results in rapid or substantial weight gain. On the other hand, Issues such as depression may result in a loss of appetite, which leads to weight loss. Similarly, while some people may lose total interest in cooking or eating, others may indulge in binge eating to satisfy their emotional hunger. In any of these instances, a mental health assessment is highly recommended. 4. Substance Abuse Alcoholism and drug addiction may be associated with mental illness. The National Bureau of Economic Research NBER reports that there is a definite connection between mental illness and the use of addictive substances. On this note, let us let the statistics speak for themselves. According to NBER, mental health disorder patients are responsible for the consumption of 38% of alcohol, 44% of cocaine, and 40% of cigarettes. While people who have been diagnosed with mental health disorder at some point in their lives are responsible for the consumption of 68% of alcohol, 84% of cocaine, and 68% of cigarettes. People who consume alcohol or drugs in an attempt to cope with emotional or mental pressures may gradually become dependent on them. In some cases, substance abuse can even cause mental health conditions like depression. 5. Mood Swings As humans, we may tend to experience swift changes in our moods from time to time. However, extreme mood swings can be a sign of mental illness. When your mood changes quickly or at random times, it can be something more. The National Center of Biotechnology Information NCBI, suggests that people commonly have positive mood swings such as love, joy and excitement, and it's perfectly normal for an individual's mood to change daily. However, in many cases, shifts in mood are a symptom of a more severe health issue. They can occur due to mental health conditions, hormonal changes or substance use problems. Among other things, National Alliance for Mental Illness NAMI, warns that huge mood swings can be a sign of bipolar disorder, personality disorder, MDD, 
etc. Some red flags are feelings of anger, sadness, or excessive euphoria when it has nothing to do with your surroundings. 6. Long-lasting feeling of sadness. Have you ever felt so sad and empty that no matter how much you try, the sadness does not go away? All people experience sadness sometimes. It is an inevitable part of life. Even when negative situations do not directly affect us, humans tend to feel the sadness of people around them. Even though sorrow may result from many things such as the loss of a loved one, failure, rejection, or just lack of motivation, when the feeling refuses to go away, then it should be taken seriously. The American Psychiatric Association, after their survey, reported that prolonged sadness lasting over two weeks can be a sign of something much bigger and can be a sign of depression. The National Institute of Health suggested not being able to get out of a state of sadness should be taken seriously and the patient should seek medical help as soon as possible. 7. Any thoughts of self-harm or suicide While people use different forms of self-harm like overeating, overstressing, etc. to calm their nerves, constant thoughts of self-esteem, especially inflicting injuries on oneself and committing suicide, is something to pay attention to. The Mental Health Foundation reports that 10% of people under 30 have thought of inducing harm and have thought of suicide. These feelings can be promoted by many things such as neglect and abuse at home, a significant loss, trauma, or a catastrophe you cannot keep under control. 90% of people that have committed suicide all had a severe mental illness. If you ever have a thought about suicide or self-harm, be sure to reach out to people. There are many lines you can call and people you can talk to. You don't need to go through this alone. There are people out there that are willing to help you get through this. 8. Social Isolation A definite warning sign to look for is isolating oneself and withdrawing from social interaction. It's not unusual for any of us to need some me time. However, there may be a more serious underlying mental health disorder when a social withdrawal is a significant change or persists for an extended period. Spending an excessive amount of time alone can be symptomatic of bipolar disorder depression, or other behavioral health problems. Social isolation has also been found to be associated with poor mental health, including increased risk of depression, cognitive decline, anxiety, and substance abuse. In elderly individuals, isolation is also associated with increased risk of dementia. This social isolation is not a matter of whether you are an introvert or an extrovert, although it can be easily noticed when extroverts isolate themselves. Introverts with underlying mental issues tend to withdraw from their small circle as well. 9. Illusions or seeing hallucinations There are two aspects of psychosis, hallucinations and delusions, when one's sense of urgency and beliefs are compromised. Hallucination has to do with hearing, seeing or otherwise sensing the presence of things not there. For example, you might hear a voice that no one else in the room can listen to or see an image that isn't real. It is usually a very telling sign of mental illness. The National Alliance of Mental Illness NAMI, reports up to 100,000 people in the US experience psychosis every year, which is a damning statistic that everyone should be aware of. Hallucinating can be a symptom of mental illness. They are experienced most commonly in schizophrenia, but can also be found in schizoaffective disorder and bipolar disorder. Your mental health is the bedrock of your life. When your mental faculty is not well functional, Every other aspect of your life, such as finance, professional, or even spiritual, will not be productive. Hence, you must pay attention to these little signs that may cause a dent in your mental health.